we're going to show you some techniques for measuring trees. The tools we'll talk about are the diameter tape, the 100 foot tape, and the Biltmore stick, which is actually several tools in one, the tree scale to measure the diameter of standing trees, the Merritt hypsometer to measure the number of 16 or 18 foot logs in a tree, and the log scale to measure diameter of cut logs, which we won't do in this video. Let's start with measuring diameter. Regardless of the tool you are using to determine diameter, it is always measured at 4.5 feet above the ground. That's referred to as diameter at breast height, or DBH. Use the 100 foot tape to find 4.5 feet above the ground. When you use the Biltmore stick to measure both diameter and height, the stick should be held 25 inches from your eye. The calibrations on the stick are made assuming this is true. If you don't hold the stick the correct distance from your eye, your measurements won't be accurate. If you need help determining where 25 inches is, you can use a tape measure or the log scale side of your Biltmore stick as a reference. This works because the log scale is a direct measure of inches and not a calibrated measurement like the diameter markings are. Put your thumb on the 25 inch mark and carefully hold the end of the stick to your cheek below your eye. Without moving your arm, turn the stick so that you can get an idea of how it feels to hold the stick at the correct distance from your eye. Now that you know where DBH and 25 inches from your eye are, you are ready to measure diameter with the tree scale stick. Hold the Biltmore stick against the tree with the tree scale side facing you. Line up the zero end with the left side of the tree. Now, without turning your head, shift your line of sight to the right side of the tree. Read the diameter from the marks at the top edge of the stick. Remember to always round down for accuracy. You can help someone line up the right or left edge of the stick and the tree using another Biltmore stick as a guide. To measure diameter with the diameter tape, Wrap the tape around the tree at 4.5 feet above the ground and take the reading where the zero line matches the diameter reading. Be sure you have the correct side of the tape showing. The correct side will say something along the lines of diameter in inches. To use the Merritt hypsometer, you need to locate a point 66 feet from the tree you are measuring. Be sure you can see the top and bottom of the tree from that point. It will help later. Using the 100 foot tape, measure out 66 feet. Be sure you pull the tape so that it is straight. Once you have 66 feet marked, stand at that point. Before you measure the number of logs you have in a tree, you'll need to estimate where the diameter of the tree becomes less than 8 inches. A trick that can help you is to use the hole drilled into the stick as a gauge. Hold the stick at arm's length and look at the trunk of the tree through the hole. Where you see that the trunk no longer fills the hole, it's less than 8 inches in diameter. Now you'll measure the number of logs using the Merritt hypsometer. Hold the Biltmore stick vertically with the small arrow pointing down. Line up the bottom of the stick with the stump height on the tree, or about 1 foot. You may want to pair up with someone else to be sure you are holding the stick plumb. To see why, intentionally hold the stick at an angle and see how different your measurements are. Using one eye, read up from the bottom of the stick to the closest 16 foot log mark where the tree is 8 inches in diameter. Round down for accuracy.